in the army, this is the center of the universe. This is America's 911. So when the president picks up the phone and calls 911, it rings here. These guys are ready to leave out the door within 18 hours uh, to do what the nation asks them to do. So for you guys to choose Fort Bragg, to come here and link up with the paratroopers and come and see what you know a day in the life of those guys is like, I don't think you could have picked a better place. I think the biggest thing for for the players to take back is, you know, it's a different job, but it's the same goal. You guys want to uh, win championships. Well, the nation relies on the 82nd Airborne Division and service members to win championships, right? And that's to uh, to do what the nation's asking them to do. So the players, you know, today have said, you know, they're really humbled by, by what they do, but you, know, you guys just being here is, is a testament to showing them how much support that they actually have. And, and that goes a long way in helping build them around. Being able to see our military at work uh, in Fort Bragg and the amount of you know, men and women that serve for our country, that's an honor for me and Atlanta United to come and, and visit the, the base and see all the cool things that, that they work with on a daily basis and thanking them for their service and, and what they uh, do for our country. It's an honor to play for a club that appreciates our military. I'm proud to be an American and it means a lot for me to be able to give back and say thank you to our service men and women that sacrificed their lives for our freedoms, like I said. And, you know, being able to come see it in person firsthand is, is really meaningful and it kind of opened my eyes to, you know, how blessed I am.